Joining me now is Kevin Faulkner. He is the former mayor of San Diego. Kevin, thanks so much for joining me today. It's great to have you on. Uh, my pleasure. Thanks for having me. Of course. Now, earlier this week, Governor Gavin Newsom lifted the state's COVID-19 stay-at-home orders. What do you make of this change in, in uh, his agenda as well as the timing of it? Well, it had a lot of uh, people, uh, uh, frankly, uh, uh, confused uh, because once again, we've had changing metrics here in California, open and shut, open and shut. We've had businesses that have been open and shut literally four and five times. The unfortunate reality is that California is last right now in terms of vaccine distribution. So you're continuing to see a lot of frustration uh, and a lot of anger about the constant changing back and forth out here in California. Well, efforts are underway to actually recall the governor. And I wanna talk with you about that now and sort of get an update. I know 1.5 million signatures are needed by I believe it's March 17th. So how's that going? And can you provide any additional updates on that? Yeah, you're seeing a lot of momentum. Uh, the, the numbers continue to grow uh, every day and every week to get to that target of, of 1.5 million. Um, I strongly believe that that threshold is going to be achieved. And this is Democrats, independents, Republicans, this is families up and down California who understand the sense of urgency um, to have a change uh, at the top. As I said, the fact that our vaccine rollout is so slow, the fact that our public schools aren't opening yet, private schools uh, are, the fact of, as I said, the changing metrics and the hypocrisy um, you add all of that together and many other issues, uh, Californians are at their wit's end. Um, and that's why they want to change at the top. There could be some potential change. There is, uh, you know, there are some rumors that you actually could be running for governor yourself. Now, California has been a mostly blue state. What makes you a competitive candidate in that regard? Well, I have opened up an exploratory uh, committee. Um, and, you know, I'm, if you look at you know, I just kind of finished my uh, second term as mayor, the city of San Diego, and the demographics of our city uh, mirror that uh, pretty much of the entire state of California in terms of, you know, partisan registration, et cetera. Uh, and I've successfully uh, ran and governed uh, in a majority Democrat city, uh, working with, you know, city council members on an aggressive and ambitious reform agenda. Uh, that's what's needed. You have to have somebody that can, as I said, step up, uh, make it happen, and I think that that's, that's part of the reason why you're seeing such strong support for the recall. Again, it's across the board uh, here in California. So, you know, I, I look at the success that we were able to have in, in San Diego, the only major city where homelessness has actually gone down by double digits the last two years. What we saw in terms of the growth of our economy, not chasing businesses out of our city. Uh, I did not defund the police. I increased the police budget last year because I want the best and brightest men and women uh, to not only be in our police department, but to give them the dollars for the best training. So I think you add all of that up. Uh, I think Californians are looking for somebody with experience and a common sense attitude to solve problems. And when you do that, I think that's how you have success in a state as diverse and as big as California. Former President Trump has a lot of control still and a lot of influence within the Republican Party. What role do you think he could potentially play in your candidacy? Well, look, we, we've been a, a, a party that's very inclusive. Uh, we've been a party, again, you're going to have different individuals, different issues. Um, that's part of, of a successful party that takes into all types of that. And, you know, I have some experience that, as I said, uh, being mayor of, of San Diego, a very a diverse city, and, and we're very proud of that. So, you know, when it comes to differing views uh, in and with outside the party, uh, we're a big state. Uh, we want lots of views. And, and as I said, I'm a big believer. And you go out and you win the argument, and then you win the vote. And that's my style. That's what I've done as mayor of San Diego. I think we can win the argument statewide in California. We're going to get Republicans, we're going to get Democrats, and we're going to get independents. That's how we win, win by addition. Well, Kevin, thank you so much for joining me today to explain what is going on in California, as well as these recall efforts uh, in regards to Gov Governor Newsom. I greatly appreciate it and hope you'll join me again soon. My pleasure. Look forward to coming back.